All right, Chief Meteorologist Joe Veris here with us. Now, we just talked about the Arctic League and the tree. That's a mm -hmm. Christmas charity. And a little bit of Christmas flying around in the air here and there today. That's right. Nothing to slow anyone down at all. Just a few flakes in the air from time to time. Uh, may have a little bit more snow to contend with Friday morning. Again, light accumulations, but uh, maybe a little slick on the roads early Friday morning and then again on Friday evening. No big storms heading our way. In fact, we're talking about a significant warm up through the weekend. All right. All right. Weather headlines for tonight. Uh, we are looking for again some flurries out there and uh, that'll taper off later this evening. Some uh, partial clearing after midnight. The breezy conditions settling in for tomorrow. Uh, temperatures a little bit warmer though, and we will have a mix of sun and clouds. I mentioned those snow showers returning for the end of the week on Friday, followed by much warmer conditions. Current weather map showing that weak disturbance passing through this evening. High pressure to our south for tomorrow. And that's going to give us the dry conditions with uh, at least some partial sunshine returning. But then you can see that uh, second cold front back to the north and west. And that's what's going to bring the, at least the chances for some more snow showers with very light accumulations heading our way on Friday. Latest radar map is showing these uh, light flurries passing through the southern tier right now. But you can see clearing trend back towards the south and west. And we're going to get in on some of that as we go through the day on Thursday. And temperatures do come up a little bit as compared to where they've been the last few days. A closer look at the radar map showing some flurries over toward the Elmira area. Live interactive sky, sky tracker radar is actually showing uh, a, a better idea of where those flurries are occurring right now. And wherever you see the darker shades of blue, that's where we're getting uh, a little bit of a heavier snow coming down. All this is still very light though, but just south of Ithaca, uh, we're looking at a few heavier snow showers right now. And then the northwestern half of uh, Shimon County towards Catlin, a few heavier snow showers as well. But again, all this very light activity in terms of accumulations and we're not expecting any problems on the roads tonight. As we take a look at now at uh, what we're expecting temperature wise or what we're looking at right now temperature wise, uh, 35 in uh, Syracuse, 28 right now in Binghamton and Bradford currently at 30 degrees. Uh, weather watchers tonight showing temperatures low 30s in Ithaca, 30 right now in Hornell and Corning coming in at 34 degrees. 24 hour planner showing those flurries this evening, partial clearing after midnight. Looks like some sun returning for tomorrow with a five degree guarantee of 42. So not too bad temperature wise. Uh, that's about where we should be for this time of year. Future track is showing those dry conditions for tomorrow. So we get a little break in the action, but uh, as we go through tomorrow night, that second cold front moving in from the north and west, so increasing clouds. And then by early Friday morning, some snow showers likely here in the Twin Tiers may have a light accumulation of coating on some of those roads as you head off to work and school Friday morning. And then uh, some lingering snow showers at times throughout the day. Any accumulations, though, should be an inch or less. And then those warmer conditions heading our way for the weekend. Five degree guarantee for today. Forecast high 39. We hit 37. Forecast for the rest of tonight. Evening flurries, then partial clearing late. It's going to be another cold night with low 20s out there. 22 in Elmira and in Corning. And for the northern tier, expect 23 in Mansfield and also 23 in Sayre. Seven day forecast is showing the threat for those snow showers on Friday. Saturday, mostly cloudy skies, 44 degrees. Some rain showers moving through on Sunday, but we get into the low 50s. Monday 53 and 55 the forecast high on Tuesday. Cold front moves through late Tuesday, early Wednesday, dropping temperatures back to seasonal levels by the middle of next week. But the warm up looks pretty nice. Pretty good. Mid 50s for this time of year. All right. Thank you, Joe.